Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you're logging in from. I'm not really sure what I'm going to call this one. Maybe uh, it'll be just like a question mark, then Democrats. I don't know. Um, give me your... Uh, Give me your uh, suggestions in the comments. Um, so yeah, here here we go. Um, so yeah, Democrats, it's about time to stop whining and crying about losing the election. It's getting sad at this point. I had a little bit of sympathy for you in the beginning, but uh, I always thought it was pretty funny. And uh, the other Republicans think it's funny too. And you are just giving us more ammo to make fun of you. And you're giving us more content to create. And you're supposed to be the, the party of love and tolerance when you come out and say, stupid things like oh i will shoot any any white man that comes my way and then you and then you threaten white women and you say white women are this or that or whatever or white women are just confused um, when really it's you who are confused, any Democrat that doesn't think the way you think is automatically public enemy number one, at least we Republicans aren't NPCs that all think the same. Um, and you know what? As for Democrats, um, why, why can't we disagree peacefully? So many of you love to quote the Bible where Jesus says, love thy enemy, uh, love thy neighbor, yet you, uh, you love to hate on people. And then uh, Jesus says, well, um, you say, Jesus says, don't judge. That's not what that scripture means. It means when you judge other people, they will judge you back. And he's saying, how to judge righteously. Uh, he's saying, don't be a hypocrite. He's not saying, don't judge. Because as soon as you see someone, you, you make a judgment. As soon as you see them. As people... We are incapable of not making a judgment. 
our brain just goes our brains just want to make a judgment about that person like when we see someone that's not well dressed and their beard is all unkempt and you know their clothes are tattered or, or whatever um we want to say oh that person is homeless or that person is you know a gangster or you know that person's trouble um okay so what would you look like if you were living on the streets okay um so uh speaking of love um there's babies being killed in the womb and you you don't recognize that as life that's not very loving and even up to the ninth month when the baby is kicking you say oh well we can get an abortion we can get an abortion that's fine um and then uh you're fighting for children to be aborted months after the baby is born that is insanity and then you guys support some of the craziest policies you support an open border and many of those people that have come in through the open border are criminals literally killing our citizens you know like in riley she was killed by an illegal immigrant trump said we're gonna send the illegals back and they can come back legally he didn't say they couldn't come back at all so you know i don't know what you guys are crying and whining about all these people will never be able to come back all these people are being torn away from their kids um but yeah it's, it's getting sad you really need to stop um so with that being said i'll sign out now and may the lord bless you and keep you may his face shine up shine upon you and be gracious unto you May he lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace.